right, I wasn't happy with my uh, little breadboard that I did here for the AD9822 chip. A 9833? Yes, a 9833 chip. It's the um, function generator chip. And uh, the problem that it has is when it outputs triangle waves, and then it outputs sine waves, and then it outputs square waves. The square waves are way bigger. Way bigger. Uh, oops, wrong knob. Yeah, way bigger. So when I do the other guys, they're small. And the triangle waves are really big. And I didn't like that. Did not like that. So I've uh, fixed that. Let me show you the fix. Uh, so here we go. Um, now I've got triangle wave, sine wave, square wave. And they're all the same size now. So I noticed that other people, or not other people, but one, at least one other person had a pretty elaborate solution to fixing this problem. And I thought, well, that was overkill. Uh, he had a programmable gain using this, that, blah, 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 blah. And I thought, well, that's, that's overkill. This is a simple problem. Let's, uh, let's attack it a, uh, a simple way. And uh, let me show you what I did. Okay, so here's the simple divider. So remember my square wave was big. So if I set my square wave through this section, then uh, it would get attenuated and I could adjust it to have the right attenuation, okay? Um, and maybe I could have one output for sines and triangles and then one separate output for square waves, right? And I thought, well, no, nah, that's too cheesy. I want them all on the same thing, okay? And so uh, I put a FET uh, switch in this thing, okay? So you can just think of this thing as just a uh, it's just a switch, right? It's just on or off. I've hooked up the D4, it doesn't really matter. I used a 2N7000, very, very common part, 2N7000. And you can just drive it directly from the uh, from the microprocessor. You don't need a resistor or anything. And so I found that using a 10K and a 1.5K Works just great. So my 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 program now, when it selects sine wave, uh, it 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 keeps this off, and when I have a triangle wave, it keeps this off, and then when I have a square wave, it turns this transistor off, and gives the the uh, attenuation of of uh, 10k to 1.5k. All right. So uh, that little black thing right there is the uh, 2n7000. And here's the 1.5K and here's the 10K. That's all I had to add to the circuit. And now I've got a function generator that gives me the same output all the time, which is much more useful.